We are live from Falls High Hospital, which is overflowing with patients that all have similar symptoms. Doctors say that this is because of a disease known as syphilis. Dr. Mackenzie Ryan has more information. Syphilis is a multi-state infection spread through the Trapona pallidum bacteria. It cannot be noticed until stage 2. It is very dangerous if left untreated, but easily curable if caught early. Treatments include benzathine penicillin, doxilacin, tetracillin, and surf triaxone for neurosyphilis. You can avoid it by having safe sex and using condoms or being checked every few months. We have also managed to get an interview with lab tech Krista Olson, who talks more about the origin and stages of the disease. Syphilis was first discovered by a European doctor and soldiers camping in the area. It is unknown where the disease first started. It goes by many names. Italians, Germans, and people in the UK call it the French disease, and the French call it the Neapolitan disease, and so on. The term syphilis comes from Girolamo Francastoro's book about a shepherd named Syphilus. In his book, a disease was cursed upon the human race named syphilis after the shepherd. There are multiple stages of syphilis. Primary syphilis, it includes symptoms such as painless sores that may be hidden inside the rectum or vagina. Secondary syphilis includes rashes, sores in the mouth, vagina, or anus, fevers, swelling glands, weight loss, hair loss, headaches, fatigue, and muscle aches. Some may experience a latent phase after the secondary phase. Latent phase does not include any symptoms. Tertiary syphilis includes neurological problems, stroke, inflammation of membranes around the brain and spinal cord, numbness, deafness, blindness, personality change, dementia, heart valve disease, aneurysm, and inflammation of blood cells. Infected babies may have symptoms such as enlarged livers, jaundice, discharge from nose, swelling glands, bone abnormalities, and neurological problems. While the disease is extremely dangerous if left untreated, it is extremely easy to treat if caught early. One syphilis survivor has a story to tell. I first discovered syphilis when my most recent partner called me to say that he had syphilis. I had no idea what that was, so I did some research. I found out that it's a sexually transmitted disease that is transmitted through bodily fluids. And it can also be passed on from mother to unborn baby. It is most contagious at stage one, which is what my partner had. The next day I went to the hospital. The doctor did a blood test and diagnosed me with the disease. She prescribed me some antibiotics immediately. Doctors are urging that anyone who believes they may have syphilis, please make an appointment with their doctor. Brad, back to you.